Common characteristics of BPD include fear of abandonment, rejection sensitivity, and emptiness. Fear of abandonment is that you have an intense fear that that person whom you love a lot, who you want to be close with, is suddenly just going to disappear from your life. They're just going to discard you as if you have no value, like an empty soda container. And that loss, you feel it in your stomach and you just imagine it intensely in your head. And that rejection sensitivity, it's this sensitivity, it's always having this very vigilant outlook that you are gonna be kicked out from a group you really wanna be in. It's this loss of acceptance that you'll never be part of the group that you want to connect with or the person that you want to attach to in a healthy way, in a good way. And that characteristic of emptiness, it's this hole that's inside that no matter what you try to fill it with, it just doesn't seem to fill up. That no matter how you try or the more that you do, it just doesn't fill up. And it's this emptiness that seems perpetual and just forever in place. When these characteristics surface in your life, it often creates this sense of just despair. And I think a lot of my clients would say, well, despair doesn't really capture it, that maybe there isn't a word for it, that it's hard to describe, that it's this intensity that something's just not right. It's there's something that just doesn't fit. There's something missing. There's a part that doesn't quite fit. And much like putting a puzzle together, no matter how many pieces you try, it just won't fit in. And that's that feeling when BPD surfaces in your life. When those characteristics surface, a lot of times it creates problems with significant others it can be really disruptive to relationships because sometimes it can just almost create this intense paranoia, jealousy, fear, and doubt in your partner but also in yourself about worth. Are you worthy of being in this relationship? It can also impact your relationship with close friends or even employers or other people in your life because you start to doubt your sense of value, value in the world, value in your ability to connect to others, and also it makes you question your importance about where you are in those relationships. Are you important enough to be seen and heard? Hi, I'm Dr. Daniel Fox. I'm the author of the Borderline Personality Disorder Workbook. It's time to take back your life from BPD. For more information, go to bpdcourse.com.